There's so many different pains. It wasn't in my hip at all. It was in my thigh, my lower back. It's like a stabbing. Over time, it got worse and worse, so I knew something definitely needed to be done. Made an appointment. He thoroughly went through everything. Did my x-rays. Typically, the x-ray is really there to confirm what I suspected and to let me know just how far along in the course of the disease process they are. We can do things with oral anti-inflammatories. We can do things with injections to keep people on their feet. Then typically what happens is once a patient hits bare bone, the cartilage is now completely worn off, the pain changes. He just simply told me that I needed to have a hip replacement. I'm not gonna tell you you're too young because I'm not the one that has to deal with the pain. It is a difficult decision and patients always ask me, how do I know it's time for me to have it done? I just say, you'll know. If he had an appointment that day, I would allow him to replace my hip. That's how thorough he was with the information and that's how knowledgeable, that's how comfortable I felt. When you have a hip replacement, we don't detach any of the major muscle groups so that you have a quicker recovery after surgery. In a typical hip replacement, the arthritic ball is basically cut off and discarded. And then we have exposure to the socket, we prepare it, getting rid of all the arthritic cartilage, and put a new metallic shell made of titanium that bonds to the bone. On the stem side, we actually put a stem down the middle of the thigh bone or femur bone, and we have to attach a ball to that patients universally feel pretty good at six weeks. It's a fairly quick recovery in regards to pain. Total hip replacement, typically one year after surgery, can go through a day and never once think about the fact they had a hip replacement. It's unbelievable. I'm doing everything <laughs> that I did before I start feeling the pain. When a patient shows up, what we would expect is that they get treated like one of our own family members. I just felt like I was in great hands. When you look at the capabilities of what we've had to offer a patient, it's not just us as physicians, it's the entire team. A network of therapists, a network of physician assistants, a network of nurses that help us along the way. I had the perfect doctor with the perfect tools. I tell people, don't wait. I got a brand new hip. Back to my normal life. It doesn't get any better. <laughs>